I want to play Tainted Judas for the first time. Let's get to it. Damn, he was killing those notes. He said, la, 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 la. Okay, I was a little offbeat there. I'm not going to lie. But yeah, Tainted Judas. I think this is the one that uh, most people wanted to see. Uh, at least out of all the other ones. Oh, look at this. I have a mod that tells me what the items do. Tiny Toma. Teratoma Orbital. Block shots. Deals contact damage. Splits into smaller versions of itself upon taking three hits. The smaller versions break into blue spot. Okay, it's Teratoma pretty much. But tiny. All right. Now, here's a question. This is my first time playing them. Does dark arts work inside of this room? Like, can I, I don't know, I don't know. Okay, it does work, it does work. That's really good. Speak about really good. Also really good. Uh, Not so good, but like, I mean, as long as we don't take damage, let's get out of there. Whew, that, that was scary. This is my first time using it, so it's a little scary. What the hell kind of jump was that? I've never seen a spider jump that far before, bro. Not at least with that speed. Okay, I think I've seen a spider jump that far, but not with that type of speed. Hell no. That was like a guaranteed hit of damage. Like, what was I supposed to do there? Yeah, I know with this character, we're supposed to play super aggro in terms of, uh, you know, contact damage with a dark art. So if we can get our hands on some more uh, contact damage amplifying items, I'm talking about, was it poison touch? I'm talking about Midas might be a good one. Whatever other contact damage items there are that I don't remember, because I think there's a good bit of them. I'll take anything, honestly. So another thing about uh, this dude is that uh, we don't get red hearts. I don't think just like at all, we don't get red hearts. Not allowed to. So we gotta, we gotta keep that in mind. Uh, even from health upgrades and even from our red, even from like the skeletons or the skeletal hearts or whatever the hell they're called. So very, very surprising. Keep that in mind. I'm just going to do a little contact damage to you. I hope you don't mind. Let me blow that up. Nice. Let me blow this one up too. Why not? Pageant boy. I hate pageant boy, but I'll take it for now. Don't got many options. So yeah, I think we're going to fight the beast. I don't think we do the... The alternate path uh just because i <laughs> we saw what happened last time i did the alternate path let's go ahead let's open this uh this rolls all pedestals there's not really much i could do here hold up i might be able to get some keys from the from here boom come on give me keys all right and it did not give me keys honestly really sad it gave me a bomb though hold up hold up we still going the, there's finesse opportunity nah that's not it this is the only thing i can see us doing is this boom okay and we get absolutely nothing oh a nickel k other than that though not much to work with i don't know maybe i can finesse well, what else is in the shop there's another bomb we take this bomb and then we blow up all the dudes inside of here now what is that gonna do not much if i'm being 100 percent honest but we get our nickel back and then I make a joke about Nickelback. That's it. That was the joke. There, there wasn't much to it. I'm out of here. I'm going to be 100% honest. That whole entire thing we did last floor was pointless. I literally spent a nickel to get a nickel. Like, how does that work? Oh, I did. The high priestess. That, that's an L moment right there. That's an L moment. I don't know why Dark Arts is on your, your uh, like, card slot, you know? Why is it on like your pill slot? And why is it not like a regular space bar item? I kind of don't like that. Cause that's the reason why I just did that. I activated the, the Empress card, wherever the hell. High Priestess card because of that. What's our item? Okay, at least this counts towards Beezabub. Fire Shielded Tears, kind of cool. I'm gonna turn all these dudes into hearts. Calm down. Uh, just so I don't have to do that room. Honestly, this, this character has high potential to be actually pretty fun. This is not one of those tainted characters that are like just straight up a pain in the ass. Because I know there's a good couple of them that are straight up just a pain in the ass and annoying. But at the same time, I kind of like that about uh, tainted characters. Is that they're supposed to be, you know, harder variants most of the time. But some of them are really fun variants. So far, Dark Judas seem, seeming like one of them. The most you can wish out of a... You know, a tainted variant is just a different playstyle, and that's exactly what this is. What's in here? Anything useful? Fanny pack? Honestly, not bad. I'm taking it. Only because, you know, I spent money to get in there, or I spent a key to get in there. I might as well use it. Let's get it. We got Monstro. Let me hit him with that. Yes, sir. We got our spiders out. They should apply a little extra DPS for us. Oh. I actually took a hit of damage there. I kind of just ran into him after my thing disabled. 
That's just me not knowing the timing. So I made the mistake there. No one to blame but myself. Uh, I think we're taking an L here on terms. Oh my God. This is, this is just, just pitiful that we have to miss out on this. It's honestly sad, but you know what? Angel deals go up, I hope. That's all I could wish for. I had someone telling me in the comments, they're like, gamers only tank angel deals. And I've, I don't know about that. And Isaac, angel deals, you know, they're great, but like only angel deals is the fun in that. There's a lot of cool devil deal items. And also, the deal with the devil is a lot easier to get. It's not looking good, man. I, I have no hearts. I just took another hit of damage. This is a tough room right here. It's not that tough, but like my tears are so short, I have to get really close. It's a little tough. Come on, give me, give me something. Goat head? You know, I think we're gonna end up probably getting a devil deal. Probably. So like, there's no way I don't take it. I feel like in this situation, maybe it is good to take the angel deals. Just because, you know, we don't have to spend anything on the angel deals. I don't like this room. Whatever this room is, I don't like it. What a disgraceful room. I've never seen this room before, but I hate it. Like it actually wasn't that bad, but it, it was intimidating. Hey, I'm not gonna lie. Our items that we've gotten in this run are straight up dog shit. I think the best item we've gotten is goat head. All right, we're gonna finesse this room right here. You ready for this? We're just gonna activate that and step on that button. Boom. I don't even think that's a finesse to the room. I honestly think that's how we were supposed to do the room or at least make it easier. I don't know. I wasn't really paying attention. This is where we get the carrying item. Okay, I wouldn't say exactly a carry, but it will help us. It'll help. We do this room for sure. We got to do this room. Hold up. Actually, a potential carry item. Let me do this though while I'm at it. Drop that down. We really need some tier upgrades, man. I cannot hit anything that shoots because like I can't get that close. I think we keep Guppy's heads for obvious reason. It's a great item. Uh, pretty easy. To, well, most of the time you get your hands on uh, items that buff it. Most of the time. And also, we're about to transform into Guppy, which honestly, that's that's amazing if that happens. Don't necessarily need to be carrying him, but you know. I like it. It's a better item than the Sprinkler, unless we had great tier effects. Then Sprinkler would definitely be in my inventory right now. I guess let's fight the boss. What do I have to lose, right? I don't like this boss. I don't like this boss at all. First form, not bad. Second form, terrible. Oh. I just noticed that we're only fighting his second form. Because we're fighting a champion version that just starts on the second form. <laughs> so I was not expecting the brimstone attack that early, if I'm being honest. Alright, we should be good, though. I mean, yeah, I guess I take it. It's like, what do I do? Do I... <laughs> I can try and take one of these. And then just pray that the, uh, I, the extra life ticks in. I can't, though. I can't. That's too... <sighs> That's, that's too much RNG I'm relying on. And I have terrible luck. So relying on RNG just period, that's asking for too much. I'm at the point where I just need to become Guppy and the run is saved. Maybe not saved. The run will go a lot better. Hold up. Bookworm, that's not bad. The only problem is if we take Satanic Bible, it locks us into devil deals. Uh, which, it's not that bad. Yeah, I'm taking it because like we need it. <laughs> We need it. We literally need it, bro. Oh, fuck. Oh. That was an L of a room. I'm not gonna lie. I really don't like dark arts being on the trinket spot, bro. <laughs> not the trinket. The pill spot. The card spot. Whatever. It's just, it's just, it's an L spot to put it on. Like, why? I just accidentally used my full card because like it uh, <laughs> okay another terrible item in terms of helping us win this run <laughs> I don't know bro at this point it's uh, anyone's guess if we uh, get far in this run or not I think I can make it a decent amount off of willpower alone but there's only so much willpower can carry us in an Isaac run because like if I get to dogma I'm not even gonna say beast. If I get to dogma and I'm over here doing like what 3.50 damage, like I don't think we're getting further than that. Wow, chaos. I can't wait to get my hands on that and use it. Now I love just taking damage, that's why I do it so often. I swear to god, every time I get a chance to like finally get a good shot by it's always greed. It's like the game knows. 
It's like the more money you have, the more of a chance you run into greed. That's probably how it works, and I just don't know. Played Isaac for like eight years, and I don't know that. Bombino, Bombino, I'll let you know right now. If I had the chance, I'll, if I had the chance, no, I'm taking that coin. If I had a better chance, not my current chance, I would drop you some coins. No, I'm lying. You keep hitting me, so I don't want to drop you coins anymore. I could have dropped some coins right here, but let's see how many. <laughs> okay, I guess not, but that might be better than the poop. At this point, the game is just making fun of me. What, what happened to Satanic Bob was saying that I had 100%? Oh, Seraphim? <laughs> I have to take Seraphim, bro. That is, uh, that is a game changer. If you guys don't know what Seraphim is, it is like the, the brimstone, the angel brimstone equivalent. So like, low key game changing. <laughs> Maybe that dude in the comments was right. Maybe he was right. I'm taking angel deals 24 seven from now on. No, I'm just kidding. But I see the light. I definitely see the light. Coat hanger, can't go wrong with that. I do need to get more damage though because Seraphim is not gonna be useful without damage. Cause the charge takes forever. Oh, I could fly, I forgot about that. The charge takes forever and uh, you know, takes forever and you're not doing damage it's not the greatest item it's still good but it could be better whoa two ultra prides what the all right that was really stupid there but i had a great lineup on him so i had to do it honestly i think we take this we take this because uh we're one item away from guppy transformation oh perfect this could be it right here no oh, okay so but i think this is legit how we get our guppy transformation what a booty cheek shop but I will pick this up. I will pick it up. I will get a pill from it. That's fine. We have spirit hearts. So I'm not worried about HP down. But yeah, I will do that just because it's towards the uh, mom transformation. And you know, any transformation is a good transformation. Most of the time. Let's, yeah, let's fight the devil. The fallen? Literally fight the devil. I don't even know why I said fight the devil. Right, they are dead. Get to use my satanic Bible. Uh, what does this do? Oh, one full. I don't have red hearts. I don't know if that's gonna be useful. Brimstone, regular brimstone. I have to. <laughs> I have to. Now I got seraphim and I got regular brimstone. There's no way I lose this run. Yeah, I literally can't use this. So I'm not even gonna pick it up. But wow, that is uh, that is some uh, poggers up moments right there, if I do say so. Wow, I found both secret rooms in one room. <laughs> that that's also very poggers. Okay, we finally got a bad pill. It's fine. The RNG has been crazy, so like you know, one bad pill isn't bad. Oh wait, here we go, baby. I knew Guppy was coming. Oh my. This is one of those Isaac runs. I might as well use bad gas in this room. Just fart on a brain. What a weird sentence. What? Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. I took damage. Oh, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Shot speed up. Beautiful. And I can use the strength and get a permanent just free heart. Never mind. That's not how it works. I thought that's how it works. Why doesn't it work like that? What the hell? I don't feel like that should work like that. Why doesn't it work like that? Low key, not not even low key, high key. I still don't do any damage, but like, no complaints, honestly. You gotta give up something, I guess. Brittle bones. Yeah, I'm not picking up. Wait, hold up. Replaces all your heart containers, all your red heart containers. Do I pick that up? <laughs> it says all red heart, and I know we can't get any red hearts as uh. Dark Judas or Tainted Judas. So does that mean that I just get free bone hearts and I get to fill up the rest of my health bar? I don't know. I don't really know if I even want to like touch it. Might be worth it. It really might be worth it just to get the extra hearts, even though like I'm I'm damn near already maxed out. And of course we fight Super Greed or Mega Greed, whatever the hell his name is. <laughs> Of course, of course, because you know, as soon as I get money, you know, I have no reason to spend it, right? Might as well put it in the good old Isaac savings. All right, let us fight mom. Sure. Boom. How much damage? Not that much. Okay. Got hit by something. I think it was the bottom entrance that hit me. Bottom eye, wherever the fuck piece of meat that hit me from her. Didn't even notice, honestly. 
Can I use this? I have the Colt. Absolutely not. I don't want that. I will take that. I'll take out my full card and we're heading to the beast. I really shouldn't lose this run unless I throw really hard. I, it's happened before, but it's happened recently. It happened last video. But like that legit was an accident, okay? Gigantic, huge accidental throw. I won't do it again. I hope. <laughs> I hope I don't do it again. All right. We got dad's note. Let's make the ascent. What is this enemy? I've never seen this enemy before. Yeah, we get to hear my favorite part of uh, the Isaac Repentance DLC. And that's where our parents argue. <laughs> my favorite. I got scared for a second. I was like, oh no, I forgot to drop a trinket. But I don't need to do that. I unlocked all the tainted characters. Oh, look, I actually did leave a, <laughs> a key in here. Pog. Hey, I'm going to pick up these brimstone bombs. We might as well. All right, we finally made it. That took forever. All right, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Okay. Not too good so far. What do we got? What do we got? Okay, can't use that. Got that Oblivion store music playing. What do we got? Oh, yes, mother. Oh, we were one item away from transforming. That sucks. I think we catch the W here. Unless Dogma or the, uh, the horseman fuck me up. Okay, good, bad start, terrible start. That always happens. I went to scratch my eye for like half a second. Literally half a second, and I took damage. It's because the motherfucker spawns too close to you, bro. I'm gonna drop the uh, brimstone bombs. Might as well. So Dogma is not that bad of a fight until you get to the one part of the fight. Now, if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. It's that dumbass attack that uh, Dogma does where he flies across the screen like at super speeds. And you can barely even like dodge it half the time. I think we are going to actually see it. Yeah, this attack right here. Got to be one of the worst attacks in the game. Because it's so annoying to dodge. And then on top of that, it's like... It's a whole lot of BS. I feel like if you don't learn it, it's an annoying attack. But I, I've gotten some experience with it. But once I first started playing Repentance, oh my god, I hated that attack. That attack was like a guaranteed three, four hearts. All right, let's get to it. This is where the real shit begins, okay? I didn't mean to use that sun card. It's all good. Wait, hold up. Wait for it. And with that double blast. We got homing now, so I shouldn't have to worry too much. I don't know if I talk shit about our fly that we have, but the, the fly that we have has been clutch as hell, man. That boy really is a trooper. Shout out to the fly. Can I just drop bombs? Okay, if I drop a bomb, it just goes straight to the floor. It's all good. If I can just drop it on top of him, you know, nice little damage he gets to do. Go ahead, might as well. Drop another one. Okay, that one missed somehow. I'm, does he know I'm behind him? I'm not gonna lie, my favorite thing about fighting the beast and the horseman, I like everything except for doggy. Uh, they're actually, like, really easy to, like, dodge and shit. <laughs> Which I don't know if that makes them necessarily easy themselves, but like I legitimately enjoy fighting the beast in these guys. Especially if I'm in like an Isaac mood. Oh, I took my first hit of damage. If I'm in an Isaac mood and I remember all the attacks these dudes do, like it's legitimately a fun couple of attacks to dodge. It's kind of annoying that I still take damage sometimes. I literally have like iframes that I could pick and choose from. Like I just gotta remember that as I still take damage. Now, I'm trying to output damage. This is why I'm taking damage, okay? Calm down, calm down. The beast also has to be, like, probably my favorite looking Isaac boss. Like, look at him. The dude looks funny as hell. I forgot about that, like, giant brimstone attack. I, okay, I'm just taking free damage. Like, I usually do enough damage for him to just switch sides before I get hit by that giant brimstone attack. Okay, I'm seeing some attacks I don't remember ever seeing before. What the hell are half of these attacks? All right, he's dead. That was so long for having double brimstone. Like, I've seen more attacks than I've ever seen before. <laughs> but we took the W as one of the tainted characters. First time playing tainted Judas? And I take the dub? What? That's crazy. 